hi guys you're welcome back to my channel in today's video tutorial i'm going to be showing you guys how you can find and copy your usdt eruc20 wallet address on okx so guys it's very easy to do and this is an essential skill for anyone using okx to manage their cryptocurrencies as it allows you to receive usdt and other ecru20 tokens don't worry if you're new to OKX or if you're using OKX for the first time or if you're new to cryptocurrency in general or walk you through each step in a clear and a concise manner. So guys, want to know how to do this, just make sure you follow me to the end of this video and if this video is helpful to you, please consider liking, subscribing and leaving a comment as that will help grow this channel. So guys, let's get started. So guys, now the first step you have to take now is to tap on your OKX app to open it. So let me do that right away. So guys, now you can see my OKX app is opening. So guys, once your OKX app opens up, the next step you have to take now is to tap on Wallet. You can see there at the top, make sure you tap on Wallet. You can see there the arrow is pointing at it. So let me tap on it. So guys, now you can see what is written here. Welcome to Web3. So guys, after tapping on Wallet, what you have to do now is to scroll upwards. So let me scroll upwards. So guys, what you have to do right away now is to tap on Crypto. You can see there the arrow is pointing at it. It's already selected. So guys, after that, what you have to do now is to tap on where you can see USDT. You can see there the arrow is pointing at it. So guys, you can find the USDT crypto right here because I've selected it. That's why it's appearing here. But in case you can't find your USDT crypto right here, what you have to do now is to tap on where it is written, Manage Crypto. You can see down there the arrow is pointing at it. So let me tap on it. So guys, under this Manage Crypto, you will find the cryptos that you've selected and the one you've not selected. As you can see here, these are the ones that I've selected, the one on red mark. You can see there why this one down here on blue on this plus sign are the ones that have not selected i've not selected this one on this blue plus sign so guys in case you can't find the usdt crypto that means you've not selected it and as you can see here mine has been selected you can see there that's why it's showing that red if i want to remove it from that crypto page the one that we just left now all i have to do is to tap on that minus sign then it will be removed from that page let me tap on it so you see it so guys now you can see usdt has been unselected it has been removed let me go back to the previous page now to show you guys that it's no longer there let me go back now so guys now if you look through here now you're not going to find the usdt any longer you can see it usdt is not here so guys now if you can't find usdt here what you have to do is to tap on manage crypto so let me tap on it right away again then what you have to do now is to look for the usdt crypto you have to scroll through to look for it in case you're finding it hard to actually look for it what you have to do now is to tap on the search bar at the top you can see there the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on it then what you have to do next now is to type in usdt so let me type it in usdt so guys now you can see the usdt crypto there at the top the arrow is pointing at it you can see it usdt theta so guys now for you to actually select this and add it to the previous page that we just left what you have to do now is to tap on the plus icon you can see that the arrow is pointing at it so let me tap on it so guys now by doing this you have been able now to select usdt so let's go back now to the crypto page let me go back then let me refresh Wow, guys, can I see USDT is now appearing there again? Remember, I removed it before and I've added it. So, guys, now I've been able now to show you guys how you can actually add USDT to your crypto list. And you can do it for any other crypto at all. All you have to do is just tap on manage and you'll be able to search it out. So, guys, now the next step to take now in order to actually find and copy your USDT ERC20. So, tap on it. You have to tap on USDT. So, guys, let me tap on it right away. So guys, the next step you have to take now is to select the network of the USDT that you want to receive. So guys, now for you to do that, you have to tap on that three horizontal bar at the top right corner. You can see there the arrow is pointing at it. So let me tap on it. So guys, now you can see these are the list of networks that we have. So guys, the right one that you have to go for is Ethereum. You can see there at the top, it's already selected. USDT ERC20 is a type of cryptocurrency token that represents the US dollar on the Ethereum blockchain. So guys, the network you have to choose is Ethereum. USDT stands for US dollar theta, a stable coin pegged to the value of the US dollars. Why ERC stands for Ethereum request for comment. ERC20 is a specific standard for tokens on the Ethereum blockchain. So guys, the right network to choose is Ethereum. So guys, let me tap on Ethereum. As you can see, it's already selected. So let me go back. So guys, after selecting Ethereum as your network, the next step you have to take now is either to tap on this copy icon right there. You can see there the arrow is pointing at it. You can either tap on it to copy your wallet address or you can go further to tap on receive. You can see the receive icon there. The arrow is pointing at it. So let me tap on it so you see it. 
But guys, before I go ahead now to tap on receive, let me get to copy this wallet address. You can see what's written there, my Ethereum address. That's your USDT ERC20 wallet address. So you have to copy it. You can see the copy icon there on the right hand side, the arrow is pointing at it. By tapping on it, you'll be able to copy your USDT ERC20 wallet address. Let me tap on it. So guys, now you can see receiving address copied. So guys, now I've been able now to copy my USDT ERC20 wallet address. So guys, the second way is to tap on receive. So let me tap on receive. So guys, now you can see again, this is your USDT ERC20 wallet address. For you to copy it, what you have to do now is to tap on copy. So let me tap on copy. So guys, you can see receiving address copied as well. So guys, what you have to take note is that this wallet address right here is the same as the one that we just copied from the former page. Let me go back again. So guys, now you can see this is the wallet address we copied previously. Let's take note of it. So let me tap on the receive icon again. So guys, here again, you can see this is the wallet address. It's all the same. You can see the alphabet, the numbers, they are all the same. So guys, you can see what is written here. Only send Ethereum network access to this address. So guys, you can see this is for USDT ERC20 token. So guys, you can also scan this QR code. You can make a screenshot of it and send it to anybody. Anyone who scans the QR code will be able to get your wallet address and will be able to send any kind of token to you, which is the USDT ERC20. So guys, now I've been able now to show you guys how you can actually find and copy your USDT ERC20 wallet address on OKX. And if this video is helpful to you, please consider liking, subscribing, and leaving a comment. See you in the next upload. Bye. Peace.